Hi, I'm back with another video. Today I'm just going to be talking about M2 leaks that are official. I don't have the use, I have confirmed them. It's kind of sad that they came out because I was really expecting like more update hype and like we didn't want to see them just yet. They are confirmed. So this is a possible Evo set. Now, for the Christmas event, 2022 M2 Christmas event. The thing about this is like i like it don't get me wrong like i i like these designs I, I like them it's not that it's just i'm not a big fan of the evo thing first off the first evo was a letdown because it wasn't tradable from, 20, from the 2021 halloween event and i do own it and the reaver wasn't even that big people were thinking nick would have made it bigger but the scythe is not that big harvester, the gun is bigger than it, and that's not proportionate to each other. It just doesn't look good. But here's the knife, if this is like the legendary, and then the godly, and then the ancient, if it is an evo, which we, is not confirmed yet, if it is, it's just rumored. But here's the knife, this looks a lot like the ice cracker knife from 2020. Which again, I like the ice cracker legendary, it's actually a gun collectible now, and it's only two years old. It's really surprising, but um, it has a nice design. It's basically this part looks exactly the same, same with the blade, but they added like the silver hilt, so it's like an upgraded version to the. It's like it got like great like the little jewel in there. I like the shading. I don't have the use. Always good does good, and I know more ice sets. I don't really care, honestly, on what we get. I kind of wanted like an upgraded candy cane, like candy the knife, but or sugar, whatever it's called. I kind of wanted that, but it's okay. I'll take another ice set. I'm okay with that. Can be. Now this thing looks sick. Okay, this whole sword, it's a like a thick sword. It's kind of like Elderwood Blade where the, the blade is like super thick. I love this. It's like if Icebreaker was a sword instead of like a, a two-sided axe. This is amazing. I love the hilt. It has the purple design just like Icebreaker. And like the last one did and it has a nice ice effect maybe i don't know if this is just cut out or that's a really light blue but i like how it's like chipped right there so it's like it was like cut out of ice it was made out of ice really cool design i really like this blade i think it looks really really cool and i would love to dual wield this in game that'd be sick and then which i do own ice break i own the ice break. i own most of every single god in the game now this the the axe i know it's getting a lot of hate because it literally is icebreaker <laughs> it's like almost identical the handle's pretty much the same but just has it's, it's like a wrap instead of just like your normal purple handle um it even has a spear on the bottom like icebreaker did it has the same exact skull the exact same skull which it's getting a lot of hate because of that but i i still like it now, the thing about this is it's it's kind of like a dual-wield axe again, because, you know, Christmas items always are axes, and Halloween's are always scythe ones. But the thing about this is, it, is it thick, or is it flat? Like, if this is flat, this is going to be a letdown. Like, Icebreaker, how it's like a little flatter, but that makes sense, because this looks more like a hammer, like a hammer axe kind of deal. And it's going to be a letdown if, it's not, if it is, but if it's, like, thicker or, like, wider, Oh hell yeah, this is gonna be amazing. I love this design. I love the the, the ice out like cracking into the metal. Like he, it's, it was like forced, like hammered on there and like forged. That looks really, really cool. And so yeah, now this is not the only leaks we got and they are all confirmed, but I don't have a use. I don't have his tweet, but he did confirm it all. So this is the next thing that I wanted to check out. And this is all on M2, Murder Mystery 2 Intel, at M2, M2 Intel. Go follow him on Twitter, or her, it's just not really known. <laughs> hey, this is cool. Okay, so this is probably, I'm guessing, probably gonna be either the gifts or the shop. I'm gonna say shop. This is how it's designed, it's more of a cookie blade kind of thing. And yes, it looks similar. It's like if Peppermint and Cookie Blade were together. Like, would part to merge together, this is what you would get. Because it has the peppermint, and uh, which I love, and how it has like the swirly blade like peppermint thing. Swirly thing. I like that. And now you just have the gingerbread or the cookie-ness. 
on the side. That's really cool. And I love all the junior bread shading and stuff. Again, this is cool. This is reminds me of like a dagger or like a pirate's like sword. Like a pirate sword how they're curved, like but kind of like bone blade, like a holiday bone blade. It reminds me of. But I hope it's thicker because the bone blade is really thin. So I hope it's thicker than bone blade. Bone blade. Um. I'm so happy about this. We haven't gotten an Xmas knife or whatever this is going to be called. Probably Xmas tree or Christmas tree or tree as a godly because we have so many tree knives. But we haven't gotten an, an, a tree godly or a Christmas tree godly since 2015. And I remember when we got that because I played during that time. I remember that. I was so happy. Xmas is such a unique knife. And I know it's a Roblox gear, but it's just still such a unique item. And this looks amazing. This is an upgraded one. Um, what I'm kind of sad about is why the star is at the hilt. I, I like it, don't get me wrong, like these are roots going to the ground. That's smart. But the star, I feel like, would have been better at the top. Like, so you, that, I don't know, that just would have been cooler. But I still like it. I love this design. It's a Christmas tree and you got the ornaments. You got the, or, like, this is probably, well, it's probably like a little, yeah, look, it's a little ornament. The bottom. You got the hilt. These are like roots going to the ground, and you got, I'm guessing what's behind this is like the, um, mistletoe, or the, the, um, holly berries that are at, were on Log Chopper and Minty. That's probably what that is. Behind, behind this is probably berries on the other side. Yeah, this looks really, really, really cool. Oh, get that out of here. <laughs> Update. And here's the box. They've been using the mystery box since uh, since uh, as the design of the new boxes since um, the season one update. Well, for the holiday boxes, they've been using it since October, since the Halloween 2019 event. But since the season one 2019 update, they've been using this design of the box, and they always just change the color of it and add like the snowflake thing, like right here to say that it's snowflake box. We've been getting this for a while now, about three three years. But, I love how I don't have a use took a step further and he had icicles and stuff and ice things. That's why I'm thinking it's not an Evo because I'm guessing what, it's a legendary and the blade will be in here or the gifts. And obviously the axe or hammer thing will be at the end of the battle pass. That's what I'm thinking. You want to know why? It's because just how this is all ice themed. Like there's ice crackers so obviously the gingerbread isn't going to be in this box. Because it just doesn't cores correspond with it. That's why I think it's not going to be. But I love the design. I love how he changed it up a little. It's still the basic design. It is. All he did was probably take an editor, change the texture to ice, and like, like, clicked on it a couple times and add some ice spikes. That's probably what he did. But it still looks good. I like how he changed it. And I like how it's randomized. It's not the same on both sides. It's just like random ice. And how he also changed the texture to ice on here. So it, has, it looks like different like levels of ice. Like... So it's like din it in a little bit and like stuff kind of like the blade but it's really cool well so yeah that's all i got for, for today um again i'm trying to post more and, and i'm so hyped for this segment to update i love the christmas events they're my favorite and so yeah make sure to like and subscribe and follow me on twitter yeah you should do that you know follow me on twitter okay you don't got it but please um, you can follow me on Twitter, join my Roblox group, create some of these. I don't really promote that that much, but you can if you want to. And so yeah, make sure to like and subscribe and follow him at M2Intel. I'll link his down below. And bye.